Okay, let's try this again, shall we? Okay, part two of my Politico rant. Um, I was kind of getting into a, a thing there for a minute there. Um, maybe that's a good thing that it got deleted. Okay? <coughs> but all I'm saying, okay, is, you know, there's all sorts of activists out there, okay? I am on the bottom. Bottom, 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 bottom of the 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 bottom. Okay? I'm just one person. I'm just a frumpy housewife from Ohio, Ohio who is pissed off and disenchanted and disillusioned by all the stupid shit out there, okay? And, okay, let me just do a shout out because this guy likes to do shout outs to people. Let me do a shout out to you, pal. Mark Dice, okay? I bought your book about the Illuminati. It's the one where you have the poster of it in the back whenever you do your little vlogs right now. Yeah, the one with the yellow co cover or whatever with the big with the big eyeball in the triangle. We all know what that is. Okay, we all know the symbolism now, dude. Okay, but here's the thing. You make fun of people. You make fun of people that are still asleep. I don't approve of that. Okay, I'm your fan. I'm not going to kiss your ass. I'm going to tell you straight out. I think it's kind of petty. I think it's pretty shallow of you to sit there and make fun of people, you know, because a lot of people can't fucking help it that they're asleep, okay? They've been indoctrinated into the shit. They were born into the era of MTV where that's all they fucking watched, and now there's a whole generation of children that are being raised, and they watch TV, and they, they are instantly sucked right into it. Why? Because their parents were sucked into it, okay? It's not like these people willingly said, okay, I will take whichever pill it was in the matrix that went, that took you back to sleep. I think it was the blue one. I'm not certain. Okay? It's been a long time since I've seen that movie. The first time I saw this movie, I was like, there's a meaning behind this and I can't figure it out. Okay? Because when I watched it, I think I was like 18, 18 or 19. Okay? But don't make fun of the people. They can't help it. <coughs> okay? Going around asking people random questions to, you know, to stuff that people should know and they're all like, duh, duh, you know? That's I watched that video and I had a mixture of, yeah, at first I was a little amused going, I can't believe they don't know that shit, to, oh my god, I can't believe they don't know that shit. And I felt sad. I felt sad for them. You know, and it's like, look, dude, don't make fun of them. Don't, don't patronize them. Don't make them feel like shit because they don't know the answers. Don't plaster it on YouTube about how idiotic they are. They can't help it. They've been brainwashed. Okay? Shit, when I was a kid, somebody tried to brainwash me. They tried to hypnotize me. You know what I ended up doing? I pretended that I was under hypnosis and scared the shit out of the shrink because I thought it would be funny as hell. Okay? So, I mean, it's... it's, it's you got to be gentle with these people, Mark. Come on, dude. I mean, seriously. <clears throat> when I wake my kids up in the morning, there are some days where I'm like, Wake up, babies. Wake up. It's time for school. Time to get up. Time to get dressed. And then there's other mornings where I'm like, Wake up! We're late! Get your asses out of bed! Rawr, rawr, rawr. You know, and I'm like hounding them all the time. They're getting there, you know, getting dressed. Tuck in your shirt. Comb your hair. Stand up straight. Rawr, rawr, rawr. You know, and get your homework. Get your book bag. Let's go. Go, 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 go. Where's your jacket? Holy shit. Ah, you know? You know, oh my god, your shoes are untied. And, you know, and fucking go nuts, you know? My point is this, Mark. You've got to chill out. Stop getting pissed off at the effects and start figuring out what the causes are and try, little by little, to break down those defenses that people have in their minds. Okay? It's called cognitive dissonance. I've been doing some research. I kind of know what I'm talking about. Okay, I'm not going to say I'm an expert. I'm not. I'm far from it. But try to gently wake these people up. Because if you make fun of them, then they're really going to think that you're a retard. They're going to be like, well, what the fuck, dude? You're making fun of me. I don't know why you're laughing at me, but go fuck yourself. You know? And then all these people that you could have, you know, you could have woken up and had them realize, you know, exactly what's going on behind the scenes and stuff, and they could have gone and fought, and fought on your side, you lost those. You lost those people. You know, it's standard... It's standard people-to-people -people relations. I mean, come on. I mean, if anything, you know, going to the high school that I went to, 
going to Job Corps, uh, attending some college. If any of that taught me anything, it was to teach me how to deal with people. You know, and you got to deal with them at their own level. Even if that level is lower than yours, you got to deal with them at that level. And don't treat them like lesser than. Don't treat them like they're worse than you. Don't treat them like they're the scum on the bottom of your shoe. Don't do that shit. Come on. Part three coming right up. <laughs>